September is Blood Cancer Awareness Month, and the Nicole Cares Foundation is hosting its fourth annual blood drive. Joining us now with the details and why it is so important to donate is founder and CEO Nicole C. Bullock. Thank you for coming back. Thanks for having me. I'm glad to be here. Let's remind folks why the, this mission is so important specifically to you, because this is your foundation. Yes, uh, this mission is very important because right now there's a critical blood shortage. And so every year the Nicole Cares Foundation partners with Faith Movers Church and Versity Blood Center of Illinois to host the annual blood drive to encourage people to come out and give the gift of life. And you actually were a uh, receiving end of this gift uh, back in 2016. You were diagnosed with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma? Yes, in 2016, after months of being misdiagnosed, I was correctly diagnosed in September 2016. And during my cancer treatment, I needed several blood and platelet transfusions which helped save my life. Oh my. And prior to my experience, I had no idea that cancer patients needed blood transfusions. So it's imperative that people come out and give life, give okay. the gift of life. Yeah. And right now specifically, we're coming off of summer. It is yes. a critical need out there, correct? Yes, coming off of the summer and post COVID pandemic, people are slow to donate blood. So the regular people who would typically do it have kind of slacked off. And right now the blood supply is 25% lower than it should be. Mm -hmm. And that means that people could have surgeries postponed and people with cancer and sickle cell anemia may not have blood available when they re readily when they need it. So mm -hmm. you have a drive that makes it easy. People don't have to search it out. They just yes. need to come to you on this particular date. Tell us about what happens. Yes, I am so excited that the Cole Cares Foundation is hosting our fourth annual blood drive this Saturday, September 16th, from 9 a.m. until 2 p.m. at Faith Movers Church, located at 425 West Exchange Street in University Park, Illinois. And we want everyone that's healthy to come out and give the gift of life. And we're, we're happy to see everyone. We're ready to receive you. And, and if someone or someone you know is, is struggling with the disease, too, and have a blood cancer, you guys do more than just that, too, right? You, you make their hospital stays and their doctor stays a little bit easier. Yes, the Nicole Cares Foundation has several programs. We do education where we promote uh, yearly screening and early detection because we know that saves lives. Mm -hmm. We also have our hospital TLC program where our volunteers go into the hospital and deliver care packages and offer prayer to patients that are receiving inpatient treatment. We also just launched our support group called The Aftermath, and that's for survivors who have survived cancer, and they can meet with other survivors and like-minded people who can understand on their level. And so those are some of the programs that we offer, and anyone can take advantage of that by going to our website at Nicole cares.org as well as go there to request a care package for anyone that is mm -hmm. battling any form of cancer. Mm -hmm. All right. And you've created a, a coloring book? Yes. Yeah. And so so I am so happy about this coloring book. Uh, if I Be Lifted Up was created during the pandemic. Mm -hmm. And I was watching television like so many people and was asking God to give me something. And he gave me the idea for this coloring book. And it contains over 50 stress relieving uh, images and on each page there is a Bible scripture or positive affirmation. Mm. And so this book is appropriate for all ages and it's something that I wish I would have had when I was in inpatient treatment mm -hmm. for cancer. And so I think it's just something too you can do to relax. You can do it with your yes. family. Yes. It's it's take your mind great. off of whatever you're going through. Yes. And 50% of the proceeds go back to the Nicole Cares Foundation uh, for our programs. The coloring is so, is so relaxing. Is. I mean, yes. I love sitting down with my kids and getting a chance yeah. to color with them. So I can see how somebody who's dealing with stress can help kind of level them, center them into a good space again. Yes. It's just something you can just take your mind off the worries of this world and whatever's around you and just kind of unplug and disconnect for a few months. All right, so last year was your third annual and you reached record numbers when it came to the blood drive. Yes, last year we had record number turnout and because of that we've added an additional hour on the front end so it's starting at 9 instead of 10 a.m. Okay. okay. And we have additional staff and cots so we encourage people to make an appointment. We will accept some walk-ins but if you have an appointment you're guaranteed to get in at that time and get in and out uh -huh. in less than about an hour of your time. Yeah, which you're ready to say how long does it take and what yeah. is required of people that when they donate the blood? It takes about an hour. They'll come in, they register, uh, they have a little finger prick just to check their hemoglobin. It has to be at at least 12.5 to donate. Okay. And then they're taken over to the area and prepared to give blood. Okay. But you're laying on a cot for maybe 15 minutes, correct? Yeah. That's pretty quick. Yeah, it's pretty quick. And then after you make the donation, then you can go to the back and have some good snacks and okay. juice. Okay. You know, before you leave, and make sure you're okay. And so I just encourage people to just give an hour of your time. It could really add years to someone else's life. Like 
it had years to mine. It's been seven years since I had those blood transfusions. So I thank God for it. Awesome. Oh, my God, that is amazing. Thank you, it's cool. glad yeah. to hear your testimony. That. Yeah. Thank you. Make sure, like she said, you can, they're taking in a couple walk-ins, but make your appointment Saturday, September 16th. That's this Saturday from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Faith Luther's Church there on Exchange Street. NicoleCares.org is the website to get some more information. Thank, thank you. you. Good luck to you. Yeah. Thank you so much.